right. That was that was a good fade out. That was yeah. Shout out seven. You got you got some got some of that delicious production quality. Subscribe. <laughs> From angel to goddess, here we go. Uh, Pautena taking taking John numbers for her 44% nair ride. Dealing just so much damage already, like 54% from a couple of those nairs. But Nabu is retorting with his own up tilt into up tilt. Maybe wanted to connect one more. I don't think he has deep breathing out. Nah, no, no. there we he go. He got it earlier, but then got naired. So <laughs> they kind of ate away all the time. Oh, man. We Fit's elf tilt is so, so good. It's like. Well, he was just dancing on top of his shield. He was like, shut it up, shut it up, shut it up. And then he got the new chiller just catching. Um, he was just like waiting for him to drop shield. I love that. Yeah, I see a lot of Wii Fit mains. Uh, I feel like numbers included. Call this match like closer to even than what would initially be expected. Uh, Wii Fit more uh, more of a. Uh, oh, not as a common pick while Palutena, like that always, that tried and true top tier that everyone's been. Uh, more or less complaining about since the game came out. Uh, so, but thanks to Wii Fit's uh, incredible crouch and phenomenal damage output, as long as a bunch of her weirder hitboxes and ability to play off stage, uh, it makes this matchup a lot, if, if not directly even, a lot closer to even than uh, uh, players will give it credit for. And right but now, it's oh hard, my to God. Get around, hard to get around Palutin is Nair sometimes. So much now, and I can't help but suspect that maybe. Whoa! whoa I didn't even see the reflect. That was, that was a little bit crazy. Um, yeah, just like a good way of like actually just getting the projectile off of you. I thought numbers got spiked. What? <laughs> I thought so too. But the back hit of Florida, of course, is going to have a spike hitbox. He's going to get kicked down into the blast zone by the heel of it. Almost getting a side B spike. That would have been really, really spooky. All right, just going for the down throw, but no resets. Down throw into the bear. It does 30 or 20, 29 as the shield powers through that salutation, though it still gives uh, numbers that 2% health back. Mm -hmm. And it's like that kind of like health just like comes really in handy when you're in like a last hit scramble and you just barely survive. It's probably because you got that little bit of chip healing. The down tilt into back here though, gonna be able to find the stock for Utopian Ring. Right, parry into F tilt, something numbers is uh, seeming, seeming comfortable. Like if he lands this parry, just comfortable going with the F tilt covers both sides. Uh, all of Wii Fit's uh, forward moves, F tilt, uh, fair, uh, often have a uh, multiple side hitboxes, uh, or at least hitboxes in awkward positions from where you wouldn't really expect. Uh, like the massive ass. Wow. I would have thought that would be a down air. I really thought he just couldn't yeah. go and down air him through that. Jesus Christ. Wouldn't have been the first time. Numbers has uh, just gotten dared for charging, for charging things off stage. Mm -hmm. And that seems to be uh, Ray's current motivation right now. Is like, I'm going to dare this trainer like, He's right making now. Numbers good. Even if he doesn't go for it, he just planted the seed of doubt into Numbers' brain. Of like, yeah, you're not safe if you go off there. And the next time you do that, I am 100% confident that I'll kill you for it. Let's go ultimate and shitty dash grabs. Oh, that's, oh my god. That's, a, that's quite, a, quite the shitty dash grab. Wow, that trade was definitely far in Numbers' favor. And it's actually really unfortunate that Numbers didn't get the header out. Um, he he only got like the stall of it. The soccer ball hadn't like the exercise ball didn't get to disappear quite yet. I thought Ray was gonna chase there, but I guess he figured that he, uh, Numbers was too high and it was so just as safe to to keep on ledge, not risk the deep breathing or any other wee fit shenanigans. You definitely don't want to trade with header here and. Lose a stock that you uh, wow, seemingly have the advantage for. Wow, and that full hop completely circumventing the uh, the neutral air, just like perfect arc around it. Um, that is going to be the down throw. It's numbers, numbers. That was bad di. That's not that's not a thing anymore at that percent. I mean, you can see uh, when he was when he was thrown up, he didn't get sent at a down and away angle. He was sent like. He popped him up. Like, that's a pop fly. I don't understand how that happened. Excuse the baseball reference. I mean, maybe he was anticipating, like, to DI in in case he got forward thrown or something. Maybe. I don't know. But that really was not it at all. However, very convincing game one from Utopian Ray. I just think it only got close towards the end of it. Um, and already, like, he has just, like, so much stage control. Yeah. Actually, is it really stage control if you're fighting numbies? 
doesn't really mean anything. I mean, that's how to play a lot of these matchups, though, is that despite numbers having his most most of his mix-ups uh, coming off of ledge, the way to counteract a, a lot of ledge gameplay is the fact that it's like, I can just use the 90% of the stage that I own and force you to eventually have to interact with me as long as you decide to keep playing on I the ledge. I love that mix-up. So he was thinking that Numbers was going to try to punish the down air, like the down tilt again, which is like normally kind of safe at that like spacing and timing that Ray was doing. So he committed to a full down smash of it, thinking Numbers would try to jump up and try to challenge it again. I wish he, you know, wish he didn't, but I still like the idea of the Ray. Oh, the ball's still active as he tries to get the up smash out of that. As his shield is gone, and I don't know if that shield poked or if it was just. Uh, or if uh, no, Ray no, he just ran up. He just ran up there and he landed right into the fully charged new Shelby. And do it. this is not a good spot for Palu in general. I do feel like Palu kind of struggles to kill sometimes. Uh oh. The footstool save. It was unintentional, but that it didn't. It looks like Palutena's teleport didn't reach uh, far, uh, far enough in that Y axis, but. All these parries. Jonathan rolling from ledge numbers. <laughs> Ooh, a quick little pivot grab. Chase him. Oh my god, that, sock, that ball was so, so scary. And you have to remember that you can't really challenge that horizontally. You can only challenge that from above. The F tilt almost killed him. <laughs> what? Uh, just neutral got up explosive flame in numbers' face, and that'll do it. Yeah, oh my god. Deep breathing dash attack. Deep breathing anything with this character is uh, kind of uh, ridiculous. As we see 38% in a blink of an eye after a couple of exchanges. There's no deep breathing right now. That's just What the... a good Tomahawk. That was so brilliant. He was just like jumping and jumping and jumping. Just waiting for numbers to hold shield for a little bit too long. He, buffered, he teched uh, buff, it, but, but yeah. Buff Really unfortunate. Yeah, people tend to maybe like do that when they're panicking a little bit. Just John Numbers has to just be like has to remind himself right now. Like, yeah, he still has like this game. He's probably gonna win this game. And <gasps> okay, 65 and in a blink of an eye. Yeah. So he F hit him, and okay. then this, he hit the soccer ball back at him. Right. Nice. There. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your timing was impeccable. Unfortunately, Waze was not. <laughs> Nice uh, nail from uh, from the edge there, just like catching the cross up jump. <laughs> Ray, okay. The problem here is that when numbers has the lead, stage control doesn't matter. <laughs> like you can use it to to funnel all of your dash backs, but all of that. He's just chasing him around in yeah. circles. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ! See, and then we fit crouching under uh, Palutena's is there, trying to uh, Ray, trying to get some sort of momentum on his side after putting. 116 relatively quickly, but now we're back at the same position he was at in stock one. That was very nice. Except so he baited one. him to go through the header. Went. Nice. So as I was saying, before numbers just decided to end the stock with a drop down back air, I like the bait from Ray, where he just jumped off of stage, forced him to go really, really deep, and then was like, yeah, you're gonna header right now, I'm gonna go for explosive flame. That was really nice coverage. That was really cool stuff. But then he just got killed by drop down back here. John Numbers needs your help if he's gonna win against Utopian Ray. You can help by okay. Thanks, helper. <laughs> yeah, you can help by subbing to house. Uh, uh, using the 16 numbers I on like the front that. of your credit card, three numbers on the back <laughs> of the experience. Only you can help out these. I'll get these numby dubs. At a certain point, yeah, I feel like. All of these games are the same. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm kidding. I'm getting nice neutral air into up air. <laughs> getting really good. Existential we're getting here. Getting really good. Oh, wow. That back air was so brilliantly spaced. There was nothing he could have done out of the parry to even try to punish that. I was looking at those. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> keeping focused. Uh, uh, so many credit card numbers in the chat. <laughs> completely lost my train of thought. <laughs> you know I can't take myself seriously while watching this. It like, game three looks like game one. Game two looks like game one. Everything looks like game one. Nope. This is, this is, this is some circle of hell that I've never been to before. I'm kidding, we've been here multiple times. Numbers is a... Uh... 
stubborn in his play style sometimes. Yeah. Incredibly good, but it comes down to like oh. he's gonna play the way he's gonna play his game, and it's, it's my all game, dependent. and I'm gonna play how I want. Yeah, and it's up to you. It's up to his opponent to work around that, whether it be by getting a lead and take, abusing the fact that dashing back an ultimate is absolutely broken. I'm or, actually surprised uh, that like. Going off, going off stage and catching numbers as he tries to get all of his resources together. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And that F tilt, that could have killed from above, by the way, because, you know, the reverse hitbox, the foot almost knocked him out. Numbers just crouched in his face. Like, I'm going to spot dodge and crouch and see what you do about it. You can't. <laughs> no. What am I supposed to, how am I supposed to react to that? It's just unfortunate. Just F's in chat for Ray. <laughs> All right, there we go. Such the a good, just is a good face. dash attack. He's just going to call him out for spending a little too much time there. I mean, I have seen this so oh. often between these two. I can't even tell you, like, what either has to do to win this right now. I want to see Ray like challenge numbers off stage and just down at him for it like one of these days yeah but you want to make sure you're not doing it on Wii Fit's terms because if you do anything on Wii Fit's terms you're gonna you're gonna need a lot of damage as we saw that deep breathing get up attack did 14. Uh -huh. <laughs> numbers like unfortunately like misspacing the header uh not gonna hit above the stage no ball there as he's trying to react to a neutral get up or some other uh, some other options instead we get get the numbers roll and numbers roll on um, nice. Oh my gosh, Numbers is starting to that's throw a, out back air. That's a lot of back That's a lot of back air. Ooh, you're dead. That wasn't, it was barely even, not, barely even a quarter charge, it seemed like. One. He's expecting to teleport through it. Um, well, okay, there we go. Finally, he's trying to challenge oh. him off stage a little bit. This is so dangerous. This is not where you want to be. Very I'm surprised that, that he was able just to get up through the up tilt. A couple back airs in it too, and looking for a direct oh, da, 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 da. See, that's what I said during game two. You have to do it on your terms, or else you're going to trade with header and die. Oh, wait, this is best of five. Oh, it's top eight. Yeah, it's top eight. I forgot. See, look at this. Ah, he tried. He tried his best. He tried. <laughs> of course, it's top, it's best, top eight is best of five. How could I have forgotten? Gosh, I am so glad it is. Now we can see Ray <laughs> adapt a little bit more and hopefully bring this to a game five. Two. Yeah. <laughs> Game three, take two. <laughs> or is it game one, part four? Game one. This is game one, part four between these two. <laughs> Numbers Bizarre Adventure. <laughs> All right. We see Ray trying, going for a little bit more of a ledge hang gameplay this time. Instead of trying to ledge trap and fall off. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> I can't commentate this anymore. I can't do this. Thanks, numbers. You broke him. <laughs> Her. Sorry. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. I don't understand. I don't understand why we were subjected to this. I don't know. <laughs> numbers just likes to see the world burn. <laughs> no. no. I thought he was going to get spiked again. <laughs> oh, it's time. It's time for this. Oh, he was outside of the range of that joke of that standing grab. <laughs> there he goes. Great, <laughs> please. Oh, the, the number the sounds don't stop. <laughs> it's too good. It just keeps working. <laughs> oh my god, it just keeps working. No! <laughs> 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 no, it's so appropriate. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> After 82% and a had a long, long series of events of just chasing numbers down, he finally was able to take that stock. <laughs> Dart has given up next to me. Uh, okay. That, oh, okay. God, that worked so well. <laughs> My jaw hoots. I've been. Right, some deep breaths. Deep this breaths is one of the first times that Smash has caused me actual, like, physical pain. <laughs> Emotional pain. I've gotten a whole lot of it. But. God, that did 40. <laughs> just, 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 
dead. You're just dead. <laughs> uh, unable to convert off of the neutral <laughs> You may not like it, but this is what peak gameplay sounds like. <laughs> Unintentionally <laughs> optimal teabagging. <laughs> I hate this game! <laughs> Ray, please dare him! Oh my god. Ray, commit to something. Ray, please commit. Ray! That's so dangerous, though. Yeah, it is. He's gonna get, like, side respect for it again or something. Numbers this time, not the iron gun, where it's on the doubt throw. Alright, just going for the forward throw there. <laughs> Landing numbers take ledge. Abandoning the gameplay of the first stock since it caused him to die at 20 and set him on this dark path. He doesn't want to like commit to like an air dodge read against numbers because he is actually less like afraid of get, like, getting hit again because of numbers baits him into committing that deep. That could be like a plethora of options. Oh, oh my god. That... See what I mean? That crouch is crazy. Okay. All right, catch, oh my catching God. the ending of the deep breathing. Just a very, very tip of right. explosive flame. Able to get Ray. Now this is quite a mounted for Ray to climb, but he basically has like the first 40% for one aerial. That's mm. it. That is Oh it's my gosh. It, yeah. I thought that wasn't going to be it for a second. Yeah, okay. it's good to eye. Okay. I almost died this Ray will, Ray I actually really sad. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I genuinely felt like I died during the set. Like, I don't think you understand the kind of physical pain I felt hearing the cartoon noises, seeing numbers just like play his own goddamn video game.